So today, um, if we were in class, I had plans to do this activity with you called comparing mitosis and meiosis. However, obviously we are not in person together. We're still in person on Zoom, um, but I can't really pass out the manipulatives to you. So we're still gonna do the activity. I still see a lot of value in this to give you some visual representation, but I'm going to videotape what you would be doing. And what I'm hoping you will do is pause the video at certain moments, you'll read through the directions, watch the video to see what you would have normally been doing, um, and then pause the video again to answer some questions in the document and things like that. And as always, if you have questions, please do not hesitate to pause your video um, and email me or reach out to me here on Zoom. So what I would have given you is um, a board that looks like this. It has three diagrams on this side, labeled diagram A, diagram B, and diagram C, which are labeled new cells. And then on the back, you also would have had more diagrams, diagram D, E, F, and G, also labeled new cells. And then in addition, I would have given you some straws. And the straws would have represented our chromosomes. I'm gonna refocus this a little bit. So you can see I have some straws in my hand. I have long ones that have blue stripes on them. I know it's kind of hard to see. And I have short ones that have green stripes on them. And so the idea was that um, if you pair them up, as in DNA replication, you would have two of the same size, same color straws together. Each straw represents a chromosome. Whether it's tall or short doesn't matter. They still represent chromosomes. So I'm gonna kind of do this without talking. Um, it would be just like you were doing, but please read the directions to make sure you're following along. There, hopefully that color change will help. And I know the straws kind of roll quite a bit, but bear with me.
feel free at any point to pause the video, even rewind it a little bit to catch what was happening. But this is a great comparison between the two different processes of making new cells.